What is up, my hollers? Well, Michael Leader here, and today we're going to be doing an unboxing for the DC Comics icons, or just DC icons, whatever you want to call it, uh, for Harley Quinn. So I got it on eBay. Pretty cool. Really nice. Here's the, well, here's the front, obviously. You guys want to read all of that. Here's the side. No man, it's, and it comes from, you know, No Man's Land, which I like a lot because it reminds me of the classic Harley Quinn gesture costume. Here is the back side yeah that much top with her with her um three diamonds the bottom sorry it's upside down <laughs> yep so yeah, guys now we're gonna open this up all right and here she is out of the packaging and man she is a beautiful figure and uh before i continue guys um i just want to apologize yeah, i'm a little sick so Again, I apologize for the sh small, I was going to say short, but small, um, if I do, you know, pause between the videos, between the video, uh, throughout, yes, throughout the video, so yeah, guys, I apologize for that, and I don't know what the hell Deadpool's doing here, you should just get out of here, <laughs> stupid Deadpool, I'm just kidding, I love you, okay, um, let's just continue talking about the figure, and man, I just love the figure, just on, like, first glance, it's just, it's beautiful, but also, too, I don't know, it's kind of random, but this is my first, uh, female figure, just in case you guys didn't know, like I have Funko Pops of a female character, but I meant like a real female, like a real character, a real like figure. I mean, I'm not saying that those aren't real figures, but I meant with the one that you can have like lots of articulation and tons of detail. So yeah, and first let's go on with her our, with her accessories. All right, and here her here. Oh my gosh, she can't even figure it out because I'm so sick. I can't even focus. Well, here are her accessories, and she comes with. Yeah, these are I think a pretty good amount of accessories. She comes with a uh, five hands, three for her. Um, I, in my opinion, I think she came with six. If she is gonna have, you know, three black. I, I kind of thought it was off that she had three black hands and two. Um, well, they're interchangeable hands and uh, two red ones. And there's it comes with her cork gun and her um, mallet. I mean her mallet, her uh, big ass hammer that she's always carrying. So let's start off with uh, the hands with the detail. Sorry guys, I'm looking at the camera. I'm just like, ah. Oh. Okay, well, it's a little blurry. So yeah, this is uh, her hammer holding hand. Sorry guys, again, for the, it's not really focusing. Man, I gotta get it, I gotta, cause I'm using my Sam, so I gotta even, I'm, I'm still uh, learning how to use the, the whole camera. And here is her, uh... come on, let's get some light in there. Okay, here is her, these are, okay, her default hands are right here. It's this one here. It's just like fist. I don't know. So it's lots of detail on it. You know, it actually looks like a real hand. And it's really feminine too. So I'm glad that they did that. <laughs> you can see that she has no hands right now. Because I took them all off. Oops. Just get this out of the way. She comes with uh, these hands, which are... Here's her, again, her default hand. Man, I really hate this. Man, I thought Samsung was supposed to be like the best. I mean, I'm, I'm so a fan of Samsung. I'm not hating on it. It's my favorite, like, company for uh, phones, for selling your devices. But I know I just, I'm hating this camera. Okay, well, whatever. Okay, let's move this. She comes with, I think this is the gun holding hand. Yep. Okay. Why is it focusing over there? It's because it's such a small little piece right here. So, yeah, that's her gun holding hand. You can't tell. Can't see, I'm sorry. Here is her other um, hand to hold the, the yeah, the, the hammer. I feel like she should came with two um, gun holding hands, like one for the red one, but oh well. So here is her hammer, which is really nice. Lots of detail on it. Looks like real wood. Looks like a giant cork to me, actually. Like from the bottles, from the champagne bottles. <laughs> to puddles, huh? Yeah, sorry guys, it's it, my shadow gets in the way. Why is it focusing over there? Okay, you know what, maybe I'll look at the... I don't know, sorry guys. Just trying to get this focus. Here is the the handle. Pretty nice, it's pretty big too. It's supposed to be big. Yeah, I don't know. So yeah, so those are her... Oh, totally forgot the quirt gun. I love this quirt gun, I'm so glad they included it. I mean, included it. Because it's so, you know, it's so popular. It's one of her iconic weapons. Which also reminds me of, um, from Batman the Animated Series. Yeah, it's, it's pretty bad. But anyways, there's, there's lots of detail on it, though. 
which I like. So yeah, now let's move on to the articulation. All right, so articulation, we'll start with that. And um, yeah, she comes with a pretty good amount of articulation. So yeah, oh, sorry, moving this around. Uh, you can move her head side to side. She can look up. Mm, yeah, not that much right now because, you know, like I said, it's pretty stiff right now. But she could look down a pretty good amount. So yeah, her leg, her legs, <laughs> her arms can move outward pretty good, about like that. And she has a bicep pose. I don't know. Yeah, it's pretty cool though. And her arm, or her what am I saying? Her hands can move around. They can swivel around. Her uh, torso area. I don't know. She could. She has an ab crunch. She could move back a lot actually. <laughs> I think she, yeah, I think that's how much she can go. Her legs can move out pretty good, like about that much. I think a little bit more, but yeah, you want to force it, especially when you first get it. You don't want to do that. You want to, you know, make sure it's a little loose and not too stiff. Yeah, her, and she has a, yeah, her leg, her ankles can move too. You can see that could move side to side, go up and down. So it's pretty cool. So now let's get into details. All right, and the details um, are amazing, actually. They're, they put lots of, it's a really nice sculpt, but I want to start with the head. And again, like, I don't know if I said earlier, actually, or not, but I only have one minor complaint, and that's that her, the, I don't know if you can tell by this, by the, I was going to say this paint, the paint is a little off right there on her, on the right side of her mask. And this I it's done pretty well. Same thing. Well, right there. I don't know if you guys can see that right there. Right there. It's a little... It's a, They kind of missed it right there. But it's not a big deal, you know. It still looks beautiful. Still an amazing piece. I like her lips. The way they made her lips really full. And it looks like she's wearing lipstick. You guys see that kind of like shines a little bit. It has like a glossy look to it. So I think that's really cool. I like the gesture ears. Yeah, here's the back of her mask, <laughs> and she has these tassel pieces right here, which are really nice to touch, actually. I don't know if that sounds weird, but it's because they're really soft, soft material, so what I, that's what I like. Okay, and then um, let's get to this part. <laughs> so her, she has a really nice sculpt for the breasts. I don't want to sound like a pervert, but yeah, has, it actually has some stretching between them, too. Stretching right there on her stomach. Or her torso, torso. I said it weird right there. See, I like that they did that. The paint again is just absolutely amazing. Her arms, that her sculpted really nice. Yeah, it really the sculpt again. You know, it's nice. And oh yeah, and the diamonds. I'm happy they didn't miss on the diamonds. They have that. They have a diamond on the left cheek, <laughs> the left cheek. I'm glad that they have that too, because that's how it is in the even the Amit series. I remember her having having on one of the cheeks. <laughs> And she doesn't have one here, so I'm glad they didn't put one here because she only has it on one arm. So yeah, then the cuffs or the ruffles or whatever you want to call them, look, are sculpted pretty nice. So basically everything is, you know, like I said, the whole sculpt is just amazing. Oh, she has a piece, piece of, I don't know what that was actually, I think it was a piece of the paint that fell off. And again, the paint's really nice. She has some stretching on her back too, you guys can see that on that side. I don't know if you, if you could show you that. There you go. Can't really tell though. But again, you know, you don't. I, I think it's, it has the detail it needs. The legs are sculpted really nice too. And she actually I remember the diamonds being on the front side of her thigh, but oh well. Not a big deal. The paint, but overall, this, the paint's still really nice and consistent. Yeah, and again, the sculpt for the legs is also really nice. Her shoes look really nice and she even has a I don't know I think this is part of the shoes where you, where you like put your feet in I don't know I mean not your feet but like where you where your hangs onto your ankle so that it doesn't fall she has a peg holes bottom of her feet which is pretty cool and she does stand pretty well too just to add that and she is a exactly six inches tall I don't have a ruler with me though sorry guys so yeah the, again the detail is amazing and yeah, that's all I have to say. And oh yeah, one more thing, is that right here around her crotch area? You got to be careful. I don't know if that's part of the figure, but if you like, 
but you guys like move it up like again with articulation I don't know it kind of like leaves a mark right there it kind of cuts into the figure but it's not a big deal but yeah so again you know that's that's the main part of the figure the details now let's move on so hey guys um that's basically the review of how to give this uh review uh, I mean this review this uh figure like a rating from scale 1 through 10 I'll totally give it a 9.5 and again, you know, like I said, my only the only reason why I get to 9.5 is because of the paint on the face, but that's it. So, hey guys, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe to my channel and the rest of the Wolfpack. And huge shout out to uh, Warlock Productions. Yeah, he re he really deserves you know the subs, guys. So really, it would mean a lot to him if you go right now and just subscribe to him. So, hey guys, uh, yeah, that's about it, and I'll see you guys in the next one.